Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. Welcome to the Stocks with Show Play of the Day. This is KKD. Nice bearish gap in here today. Did not go to the dream target in the morning. This is actually on its way down to break a new low in here, though, this afternoon. You could have reshorted this this afternoon. I did not. I did not. I am not in this right now. Yeah, this is going to break the low in here and could go to $16 this afternoon. Ah. Yeah, I'm not in it. But I got the play this morning, which was good. I like to do stuff in the morning. I just don't like to trade in the afternoon. But here's a great example of something that you could have done in the afternoon. You could have been in this. You could have reshorted this in the afternoon. Let's go over it. The afternoon trade would have been waiting, waiting for the rally, rally up in here. You could have reshorted it here. Oh, the stop in this is pretty good, actually. Look at that. Hmm. Look at that. You could have shorted this right in here. Again, you know, time of the day. One o'clock. I just don't like trading in the afternoon. It's specifically around lunch, but you could have done it. You could be in this here. Now this is a nice trade. This is a three-hour trade right in here, and it didn't even break the low. And it looks like it's going to. Getting into three o'clock, though, got to watch your trades. When you get into three, between three and 3.30, you really should be out of everything by 3.30-ish. Uh, this looks good. This has a nice risk reward in it. Under 82, you could have shorted it. All the way down here, this, this is a three-hour trade. Here in the afternoon, geez. And if this does not continue to $16 today, which it could because it still has an hour left to go, and if it breaks the low, it could. This could have a nice sell-off here right into 3 o'clock major reversal time. Look at that. It could, but I'm not in it. I did it this morning, so let's go over the morning one. Mm -hmm. So the morning one, and again, I like to trade the morning had an entry and an add point, which you could have done it too. Here. Was very patient with this weight and almost too patient. Broke here, I called the train. I literally hit so hard I missed it. I was like, uh, rally back. I grabbed it. Grabbed it, actually shorted it up in here in a green bar. Uh, some people in the room did get this jiggy in here. Nice short though, and I'm still glad that I actually grabbed it. Sometimes I pass if I miss it, and then I realize, whew, I better get it. So I grabbed it in here, rallied up, could have done an add in here, dropped on down, continued, continue, continue, continue. This went all the way down. I stuck with it. This was a late trade for me. I'm typically again done by 10 o'clock, 10, 15, the latest. Held this all the way into the drop. Tried to give this all the chances in the world that I could. 1650 was another number. I really thought this was going to go into $16, but the fact is it came in here into a reversal time, into lunch, hit a number, and that was really uh, the time of the day where you had to say to yourself, am I going to be in this all day to 4 o'clock? Which if you are now, you see it's back at the price. This is where it was at noon. Or am I going to get out a lot and call it a day? So I decided to call it a day. Uh, but to get these things to bigger targets, if they don't go in the morning, they don't always go in the afternoon. So the, the, the important thing is that you want to make sure that you make money in the trade. Sometimes they will go and make new lows in the afternoon. But I've got to be honest with you, it is so rare that stuff follows through at a deeper number in the afternoon. I'd say well over 90% of the gaps make most of their moves in the morning. Very, very few will make a bigger move in the afternoon. And it still hasn't broken the low yet. It looks like it might, though, but it has not yet. Anyways, this is a nice gap here in KKD. Really, just September. September is turning out to be not half bad here of a month, and it's we're only a week into the month. And earnings season hasn't even started. Strong start to the month here for me. The vacation that I took over Labor Day did me good. Uh, so follow this through. We'll see what we get Thursday and Friday. Trying to, to hit a big weekend here. Just, just hitting it every day. The focus, the focus, the focus. What am I focusing on? My rating system, the entries, being disciplined, focusing on the bearish gaps, following the system, getting reading the numbers right, taking the right profits out, uh, looking at the risk reward, doing all the things that I'm doing, being very cautious here. I knew today was going to be uh, a tough day for day traders to trade. I warned everybody they're in the room this morning. This is the only thing that I liked. And, uh, and it worked. And just hit it again today. I picked the best thing again today, and it worked. So that's the great thing about having a rating system. It's a great thing about having rules. It's a great thing about doing something that I've been doing now for six years. And it's really hard to believe how long I've been trading now. But time just flies when you do something that you love. I'll tell you that. <laughs>
Anyways, have a great day, everybody. If you're interested in the Golden Gap class, it's this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, September 13th and 14th, with a half day on September 15th. Email me at thestockswish.com if you'd like more information or you want to sign up. Uh, still have spots available for the class this weekend. Great time to learn my system because you can trade in the fall then and make money doing all the gaps in next earnings season, which starts at about a week and a half. This class is a strong class and a good timing here to learn my method to use to make money into the next earning season, which is the last earning season of this calendar year 2014. It's crazy that 2014 is almost over, but it's true. Anyways, have a great day, everybody. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com if you'd like more information. Thanks.